Welcome back to Materiology 4. I'm CZ Spifer. Hope you have another day because unfortunately I've got a bit of bad news. So, last episode, if you haven't watched it, which I advise you do, it was a bit shorter than normal, so it's not too bad to watch. Um, I had a problem. This dense ME cable here, I broke it about here underneath and accidentally put the block behind it, so I went to place the block behind it back. The whole game crashed. Rebooted, crashed as soon as it loaded the world. So in my haste to fix it, as I mentioned at the end of last episode, I would, I'll go fix it through MC Edit. I may have accidentally deleted my ME drive and lost all my items on it. So what I did was I went and cheated in a few diamonds, a few pieces of wood, so I could keep the farms going, and I just haven't cheated in any of our items since. So yeah. That's how I fixed the problem, but it doesn't really matter because we ain't got much left to do in this quest line, and that brings me to something good. We never grabbed the Iscard wool from last episode, well quest, and we didn't get this quest either because we crashed. So I'm going to quickly, oh wait no, I've already put Iscard wool down, uh, as we need to put you in the, at the end of the last episode. We'll put this here. Legendary reward bag, Adamite, that'll go throw you in the thing. Oh, more Tartarite arrows. I'm fed up with getting them. So, we're going to head off back to what we were going to do last episode, which was on the way back to the end, I found something. So, I'll meet you there. Into the un um, deep dark I go. Please don't like too much. So, here we are, and this is what we were checking out. This travel anchor that teleports us up here. And what is in here? Endman. Is there anything in particular up here? Uh, cats I want. Is there any blocks? No, there's not. What is this? <coughs> Sorry about the cough. Is there actually meant to be anything in here? No, it's nothing. Well, that's anticlimactic. Oh, well, let's follow the quest to where we're supposed to go next, which is telling us to. Hopefully, I didn't actually look at Enderman there. Look in the deep dark. Right, so it's back to the deep dark. I go. I want to push that button. Hopefully it'll load this time, because last time it didn't load, I had to jump out the area and jump back in. Uh, uh, no, not jump back in. I had to exit the game, I should say. Where's the... There it is. Finally popping up. And let's try the deep dark once again. So here we are in the deep dark. Now, if you don't know, the darkness is deadly and is often referred to as the Vashti Narada from Doctor Who. If you've not seen it, it's not really important. Why can't I place a torch? Oh, right, I've got no torches in that slot. Uh, you, the. Basically, it just. It lives in the darkness and it'll only kill you in darkness and it appears to give you wither. And this looks like where we're supposed to go. Some very, very colourful. Very colourful, very lit up. Deep dark thing. So it's 94 meters away. Let's see what's in here. I'm gonna torch up as much as I can because this is gonna be very, very dark on YouTube. I can almost guarantee it. Right, so where does it want us to go? Down deeper. Okay, torch here. What mobs are there around? Uh let's say F7. Or is that not is that not working? Ah, that's working now. Actually, I might keep that off for now. It's not really worth it. Right, there's a lot of mobs. Let's just try and scoot straight through. This appears to be further down. Is that? Yep, that's void. Right, so what does it want us to go from here? Level 8. 148. Uh, it's here. He wants to go to 1402-1001. Nope. Uh, 
Oh, there looks like there's something. That is a very eerie blackness. I'm going to quickly scoop, steal a deep dark wool, and let's see what else it wants to do. It wants us to go to a nether portal. There is an ocean I can see, a large nether portal across the ocean. Interesting. I'm going to have a quick peek what's inside of these towers, because normally these things are full of loot. So maybe we'll have a bit of loot in here. I shouldn't need a pickaxe in here. Or are these just facades, just decoration to make the area look pretty? It appears so. Oh, what a bummer. Well, if you weren't careful, you would have died falling straight down there. Okay, so let's get out of here and let's head over to the ocean with a giant nether portal. Interesting. Uh, so, according to this, going this way to 6, 7, one th oh, 130, that would be... Not this way, that would be... Wait, yeah, this way. No, that way? This, the way, this way. Wow, that was terrible. There should be a giant ocean with a nether portal in it. So hopefully we can find that. But we can just enjoy this scenery and murder some cows on the... I said murder some cows. Thank you. On our way. So I'm guessing this is the ocean. Looks pretty deep. Let's see what's out here. Feels like it's generating new terrain. Yeah, this is definitely terrain generation. So it may be a bit choppy, a bit low FPS. Yeah, I, th I think we found another portal. Very interesting. Very interesting. Odd design, I have to say. Let's see what's in the Never. Oh wait, no, no. It's a quest to visit this. This is a splash potion of fire resistance, obsidian, and flint and steel. I'm actually going to take that flint and steel, and I'm also going to take a flash po uh, splash potion of fire resistance because we all know the Never can be deadly. Right, just allowed the train to load, and apparently we need to go to Hep Wool, the evil railway, minus 9255. So 2 and 0. So that's 0, which way is 2? This way. Never brick. That is not a never brick fortress. That is a wither. Okay, it looks like we're going to have combat. Where is this? What level was it on? 66. So higher. Yeah, is 66. So we need to go to down here. Oh, it's minus nine, so a bit further. Oh, good. Ow, ow, wither, wither. Run, run, run. Oh, uh, 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 I'm just gonna run. I'm just gonna run down to the end got a feeling that it's going to be at the bottom. Nope. Oh no, it's 255 minus nine. Uh, this isn't good, but 255. <coughs> Another cough, sorry. Oh, it's 225, sorry. Uh, uh, no, don't hit me. 225. I should have grabbed that quest there. Yeah, and we need to go find hemp wool. If I'm going to guess, it's going to be right down at the bottom. And you are supposed to fight your way all through the withers. Like, I'm going to fight my way through all of them. That is way too many withers to fight. Not without impenetrable armor. So I'm just going to fly down to the end, I'm going to keep an eye on the centre, in case I see anything, uh, get rid of F3. I quite like this fortress, it looks pretty epic, it's apparently a railway. Interesting. Is there something at the end? Oh yes there is, right. Breach in here. Grab the heck wool. You know what? That might actually be 
everything except for secrets, community spatial IO, and make no wait, we've still got lots of the lost in time. Oh, and the cookies. Might actually be done. We're nearly done. Right, I'm gonna head back to the overworld and look through the quest book and see what we have left to do, because we might actually be nearly done. So, from what I've been looking at, all we have left to do is actually the cookies, the community spatial IO areas, and the secrets. So, let's grab these two, a bunch of reward bags, and let's go to the Victory Monument and place down the last two fabrics of space and time. The Deep Dark Wool and the Hep Wool. We are done. The fabric of space and time has been restored. And nothing epic happens. Oh well. Right, so let's have a look at these community spatial IO areas. So we got unlock the end side, end swirl, redstone meltdown, amusement park, memories, the tormented, and fright night. And they appear to use cookies. Right, so after a little bit deeper looking, they appear to get a bit more expensive as you move along to the right. So we're going to start off with the very first one on the left, which is three triple compressed cookies. So I'm going to grab an octuple, or maybe three triples, see what I've got. I'll do three of them. Oh, that's four. Oh, yeah. Six octuple compressed cookies. So we're going to mainly submit these. Claim our reward and let's go explore end side. That is the first one, right? Yeah. Ooh, it's got some of its own achievements. Interesting. And these are made by the map maker Parcel f for uh not made by Parcel, this is made by Cube Cube Melon. Uh Spatial IO. Drop you in there. Right, so this is a very interesting looking area. Uh, let me just throw on F7. Ah, uh, looks like they're hiding stuff. Very dark areas. This is supposed to be somewhere around. Ooh. Drop down shoot. Uh, let's just throw down some torches around here just so we don't get mobs spawning up here. And let's have a look what's down here. Villager. Hello. Carpet. Oh, a chest. What's in the chest? Oh, cat. Ow. Maybe we can play some music later. These are note blocks. Oh, looks like our villager bit the dust. Oh, I always liked villagers. Ooh. Looks like an industrial building spilling out toxic sludge. Mm. Ah, spider. What, what liquid? Ow, ow, that's hot. That's a hot metal. Ow, right. What are we doing in here? Let's have a look. We've got some quests. We've got to find the evil statue. We've got to find a particular music disc, not the one that we found. Moon pearls and Enderman's hard hat. Well, if I was to look around here, this looks like a construction site just by its wireframe mesh. So up here is the Enderman's hard hat. Huh. That was pretty easy. Well, let's go explore some of these buildings. So, uh, that's a lot of mobs. That is a lot of mobs actually. Let's just, just start firing everywhere. Try and thin out some of these mobs and see what's actually going on. Right, you. I said goodbye, you. Are you after me? Missed him. Nope, that's the wrong button. Oh, on that button. Alright, let's see. What's in these buildings? Blaze. Okay, pickaxe. No! Bad creeper. 
This pickaxe may be a little too fast. Ooh. It's an ear creep. Uh, no, zombie. Okay. Uh, what's in the next one? That's too far. Skeleton. No, I just want to break the pick. Go on there. Thank you, skeletons. Nope. That was the wall. What is this made out of? Lapis Salios Nox. Or black. <laughs> Hello zombies and creepers. Are these no that's all of them, right? Pickaxe. In we go. I just wanna get rid of creepers, but that's the worst one. Then zombie. And then skeleton and you know what? Turn on magnet whilst I'm here. It appears if if these guys are a little bit more interested in that villager. Okay. So we've still got things to look for. Let's see what else is around here. It's a very colourful area. A bit odd, I do have to say. There's that villager. Alive, just about. There's quite a few zombies congregating around here. And then... The Ooh, what's that? Oh, this block stuff is so weak. Because my, uh, even my sword keeps destroying it. No! End of the spawner. Oh, that's evil. It had the um, fast spawner stuff on it. The cursed earth underneath it. That increases the rate of which natural spawners actually spawn. Interesting fact. Uh, ow! Oh! Didn't realise I was that low on health. Let's heal. Let's get down a torch and I'll be back in a second once I've healed. Right, we're back and it looks like there's stuff up here. I've got a feeling... Oop, is that a chest there? Or is that a... No, that's not a chest. Skeleton. Thank you. Oh wait, that is a chest. Ooh, these are the moon pearls. Are they in... Ah, yes, they are. So there should be one more. Oh, there it is. Ah, I'll it up at first. So that should be the moon pearls, qu moon pearls quest done. Ah, yes, so we're looking for the obscure tastes and the secret tomb. If I was music, where would I hide? What was this? Was this the prison that we, the prison like area we took? Yeah, this was the prison like thing. Uh, what block's that? Oh, it's one of those Zetos. Ah, uh, I'm on fire, I'm on fire. I don't like being on fire. I'm on fire, I'm poisoned. Could things get any worse? I actually, don't say that because I'll get withered. This building looks like it could be promising. Well, this floor's made of gold. Oh man, that's slightly trippy and light. A very nice face at the top, thank you. Thanks for the smile. Let's see what's up here. Looks like you were supposed to parkour up it. Okay. Light, is there something up here? So if you were meant to parkour up it, and well, it looks like there was meant to be parkour. Ooh, stuff over there. Is there something up here, or is this just a wild goose chase to the top of the tower? Appears so. It's not very nice, but what's up here? We have some. Oh, that's that super rust. L um, ore, along with some silver. Interesting. Oh, I do like being able to break end so, so fast. Looks like we've got more of it over here along with some gold. Creeper. Stay back. This is my yours, not yours. Hmm. What else? Oh, there's a room here. Oh, this is where we came in. Ah, uh, oh well. Uh, could it be over here? 
Ooh, TNT. Probably a blow up. Oh, right, yeah. We've got, uh, there's no mob damage on this, is there? So they can't blow up TNT. I'm never one to say no to blowing up TNT, but I just want to check if there's nothing there. Right. <laughs> nope, there doesn't appear to be anything important in there. So I'll stack this TNT up and let's have a little explosive party, should I say. Uh, what's the exit? How did I get into here? Ah, uh, there. Where is my igniter? There it is. Let's watch things explode. Hopefully this doesn't like the computer too much. Ooh, satisfying. Ha! We blew up in a nice open area. Looks like we've got ores in that thing there. I don't like this area being so dark. It Ooh, ladder. It feels, um, how would I put it? Like, I can't tell what's going on. Ooh, spawner. Spawners are a good sign of stuff, ha stuff being there. Get rid of this spawner. Light the area up. Annihilation plane. Why is there. Oh man. A stir case of annihilation. <laughs> Sounds odd, oddly ominous. Right, I'm going to heal up by eating some uh, bacon. And I'll be it back. appears that we have unfortunately run out of time for today's episode. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did so, hit the like button. I'm going to. Not go any further than this. I'm just gonna quickly. I want to check what's behind what appears to be this wall of annihilation planes. I'd have to guess, and then we'll end. So, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Appears to be nothing. If you've got any comments, questions, drop them down in the comment section below. I'll add to do if possible. Stay well and survive out. Uh, spiders.